Indonesia held presidential elections this week, and as polls closed, instant counts indicated that the former mayor of Jakarta, Joko Widodo, was leading his opponent, ex-army general Prabowo Subianto. Both candidates declared victory. Joko Widodo, nicknamed Jokowi, spoke on Wednesday before a crowd of 2,000 supporters in central Jakarta. Our victory today is not about Jokowi, it's not about the political party, but it is a victory of the people. Jokowi's strength lies in his relative youth and a reputation for getting things done as the capital's mayor. He began the campaign with a huge lead in opinion polls, but that support seemed to have eroded. This supporter was relieved. We are very pleased with the result, and thanks to God, because people's power is bigger than any other power. But an hour later, Jacobi's opponent, Prabowo Subianto, a former army general and representative of Indonesia's old-school politics, also declared victory for his ticket. Prabowo has lots of support and money from Indonesia's establishment and protected a tough, no-nonsense image. There are 190 million eligible voters in Indonesia. More than 70 percent took part in the election, and it'll take some time to collect and count ballots from around the sprawling archipelago. Official results aren't expected for another two weeks. Airwaves, a global channel of uncompromising stories. World news, documentaries, entertainment, and culture. Link TV, connecting you to the world. For more information, visit linktv.org.